what's up what's up family wagwan welcome back to my channel welcome back to chef crispy tv now guys i've gotten a few requests to make a jerk dipping sauce so today's video is about making homemade jerk dipping sauce and i'm going to be using my homemade jerk sauce so if you guys want to see that video click on the link above to see how i make my homemade jerk sauce so today i'm making homemade jerk dipping sauce so these are the ingredients i'm going to be using today guys as you can see like i mentioned before this is my jerk homemade jerk sauce i got some ginger onion and garlic so these are finely minced and what i'm going to do i'm going to saute these items before i add my other ingredients i'm also going to be using brown sugar but if you don't have brown sugar you can always use white sugar but for this sauce it is better to use brown sugar i'm also using some red wine the red wine is optional but i like to add red wine when i'm making especially a jerk sauce a or a jerk dipping sauce all right guys stay tuned so guys shout out to my new subscribers so shout out to people that have been subscribing to my channel and supporting my channel i really appreciate you guys so like i mentioned before this is just a quick recipe a simple quick homemade jerk dipping sauce Brick. Brick, pam, brick. Brick, pam, brick, pam, brick. it can be used with jerk chicken jerk shrimp or anything you make that's jerk all right so first i'm going to start off by sauteing my veggie herbs so i'm going to add about half teaspoon of olive oil and i like to saute my veggies first so i'm going to add some garlic and i'm going to add some ginger and these are two tablespoons each of ginger garlic and onion so ginger garlic onion two tablespoons each and you're just going to saute these for about a minute or two minutes before i add my other ingredients okay so now i'm going to add a quarter cup of red wine then i'm going to add one cup of pineapple juice so you can use pineapple juice you can also use guava juice if you like so whichever one you have at your disposal you can use pineapple juice or guava juice and that's one cup and now i'm going to add half cup of homemade jerk sauce and like i said this is my homemade jerk sauce and that's the jerk marinade so what i'm making now is a jerk dipping sauce that could go or that could serve alongside with your jerk meals i'm just gonna stir it for a bit now i'm gonna add one cup of ketchup So like I said guys, this is a simple recipe that you can make at home. Just get the ingredients and you make your homemade jerk dipping sauce. Then I'm gonna add half cup of brown sugar. And if you don't have brown sugar then you can always use <coughs> and if you don't have brown sugar you can always use white sugar. I'm also going to add one tablespoon of browning. If you don't have browning, you can also use gravy master. So it's one tablespoon of browning. I'm also going to add half teaspoon of cinnamon, ground cinnamon. Let's give it a little extra flavor then I want to add about one I'm going to add about half teaspoon of salt and I'm using sea salt and half teaspoon of ground black pepper whole pepper 
So now I'm going to allow this to simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes on low heat, medium to low heat. I'm going to taste it a bit to make sure it's good. Mm. It's so good guys. And you can always make the adjustment based on your preference. So if you don't like your sauce to be that spicy, if you like a mild sauce, then you can use less jerk sauce. But if you want it to be more spicy, then you can always add more scotch bonnet pepper or just add more jerk seasoning. So it's a matter of your preference. Remember guys, you can always make adjustment to a any recipe to suit your preference. Alright, so I'm going to allow this to simmer for about 15-20 minutes and that should be it. Stay tuned. So quick update guys, my sauce is looking good. And this is the texture that you want to get when you make a jerk dipping sauce. And this is a very good sauce guys. And like I mentioned before, it can be used with pretty much anything that you want to use it with. Anything jerk and even more. So this is a nice, looking so good, looking rich, jerk looking sauce. Guys, I want to thank you guys for watching. I want to thank you guys for support. I want to thank you guys for supporting. I want to thank you guys for subscribing and checking out my channel. But for everyone that have been asking for a jerk dipping sauce, here is the recipe. Um, you can make adjustment based on your preference of how spicy you want your sauce to be. But I want to thank you guys for checking in today. I want to thank you guys for supporting me as always. Really, really appreciate you guys. So this is my jerk dipping sauce. Alright guys, thank you. Chef Chris B out. Yeah.